So um, I'm at the siding, uh, or at the area where the Durham Gorilla siding was, and I am finding really interesting tracks. Um, I found one of the nice that I put pictures up on. Uh, this is the second track I found. I'm going to go ahead and outline the track so this will help. It um, goes around here, comes up this area. Um, I sent this to Stacy Brown. She told me to clear out some of the debris. Oh, no, this is just the ground falling away. And uh, it's hard to say. This thing, if it is a track, you know, if it is a track, it goes down. I'm going to try to use this as a, as a measurement tool. This is kind of what I'm looking at here, and it moves. And that's the end of the track. And you see right here where a piece of the ground fell away. This up here, I see both kinds of things show. This is unusual. This is actually a really nice angle. Um, uh, like expect to see with a foot. It goes right across here, about that angle right there, to there. So it's about this wide. And up here is probably, uh, actually, you know what? I can actually get a degree. Um, yeah, I don't know. But this is not too far from the other one. I really don't know if this is the ground falling away or if it's a track. It's been, um, it's been froze, and so the ground is kind of pushed up underneath of it, so I legitimately don't know what this is, but it's right by the other tracks. When I'm finding stuff like this, I, I just don't know what it is yet. The only thing I can really do is just cast it and uh, take a look later. And, I, and really, I think that's the best thing to do with anything you find, is just cast it, take it home, um, have people check it out that know more than you do about it, and hopefully... Uh, determination can be found of what it actually is and, and this is interesting right here there's a seedling can you see that there's a seedling in there so it tells me this is at least a month old you know for there to be a little seedling popping up but I'm gonna keep looking for tracks and hopefully hopefully I can find some more I'm in a really cool area like I said I'm behind the Jones Cemetery um, right in Durham Maine right where the Durham gorilla sightings were they did tra cast tracks back here, back during the Durham Gorilla sightings, and so this is, this might be the kind of stuff that they were casting. And without somebody literally looking at it, we can't make a determination what it really is. So I, I, I'm really excited to get a hold of the the tracks that they may have cast back then, and, and, and compare them to what I have, and also try to figure out if either one of them are actual tracks and not just the ground fall it away. But I'm going to give you a quick view of everything, and then I'll upload this. It's a pretty cool area, for sure. Like everybody likes to say, it's squatchy.